Hey guys, I'm your host of Art and Graphic Design, and today I'm going to tell you a bit about Sketchpad 5.1. Okay, so from Google, you can Google Sketchpad 5.1, and then click it. Okay, the other way is to go to the website. So enter sketch.io, enter. And from here you can pick a language. So you speak German, Italian, French, lots of languages. Okay, click your language. It will bring it up. So, this is an awesome program. It's web based. It's a free online drawing program. It's similar to Adobe Illustrator. So, over here on the left side, your toolbar, you have all different options. I'm going to start out by showing you the user guide. So, other things about Sketchpad. You can download it for $4.95 onto your Mac or PC, then you can work offline. Then you can also export files to JPEG, PDF, PNG, or SVG files. Okay, so let's just start out checking out the tutorial. So click on the lower left, see the question mark with the circle around it? User guide, click on that. It's going to welcome you to Sketchpad 5.1. Scroll down or use the arrow key to move down and click on the next button. So now it's going to show you the different tools you can use. So the tools are here. This, these are the different tools. So go back. Oop. Click next, go back. So here again, here we are, tools, brushes. All you have to do is bring the cursor over the area and it will start playing the videos. You don't even have to click it, it automatically starts playing it. So it's showing you the different tools or brushes for drawing. So it was pencil, pen, now colorful paintbrush, different types of arrows, curved arrows, straight arrows. You're using the mouse or arrows, or you can use your fingers on the pad to scroll down. Sketchy, hearts, all the girls love hearts. Eraser, if you make a mistake, you can use the eraser to take that off. Another option is to click over here on the undo button. That will remove the last thing that you did, and if you hit it again, it will take off the thing before that, and on and on. Back to blank paper. Okay, calligraphy, streamer, crayon. You can also pick the colors for these. A lot of options. Spray paint, fur, I think it looks more like feathers. Web, like a spider web. And spirograph. So when you get to the end, you're going to click on the next button. So it automatically brings you to the next set. So we looked at brushes, now it's going to show you stamps. There's over 1,000 different patterns or stamps. You can use these for fun. If you're making something commercial to sell it, then you would need to get permission from Sketchpad. Probably those shapes would be okay. Okay, click next. Now it's going to show you some different types of lines and different ways you can make those. Some 
geometric and organic shapes. You can combine those to make something really funky and cool. So you can experiment to come up with different types of lines and shapes. See what you can create. So now we're over here on Path. It's another type of drawing tool. So look at all the flexibility you have. So it's just explaining what you can do. It has the words up here and it's showing you the video. It's showing you where to click. Click next. Now it's going to show you shapes. So there's a lot of options. A lot of different things you can do on Sketchpad. So have fun experimenting. Try different things. Don't worry, you're not going to break it. So this is Sketchpad 5.1 made by Sketch.io. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.